A father in Waxhaw captured cars and even a logging truck passing stopped school buses. Investigative reporter Paul Boyd is live for us tonight near Newtown and Cuthbertson Roads. And Paul, walk us through more of what you've seen about this problem. Yeah, Erica, this is just one bus stop in Union County where there are concerns for student safety. You essentially have cars and large trucks driving by stop school buses right here on this road and others. Brad Cunningham waits for his son's school bus every morning and afternoon with his phone camera rolling. I will. Today, all the drivers stopped moving while his second grader was dropped off by his school bus. But watch this. Right there, right there. And here's another day. The bus stopped, really? but drivers didn't. A logging truck. With the arm out and the red lights on, that people just keep on driving through and go past the bus. Um, illegally, and this happens all the time. Brad's family lives on the corner of Newtown Road and Cuthbertson in Waxhaw. He's been posting the bus videos to social media and found he's not alone. So what's happening here is happening all over Union County. Union County schools say they operate 283 buses every day and make more than 1,600 stops. The Union County Sheriff's Office told me it's impossible to monitor every bus route for violations, but say they do target problem areas as they come up. I want my son to be safe. Brad says he's seen an uptick in sheriff patrols and appreciates the efforts, but says drivers and concerned parents need to be proactive too. Um, take down a license plate, call the police. Um, us citizens have a responsibility about this too, and I'd like to see more of us involved instead of just waiting for something bad to happen. And the Union County Sheriff's Office says it is looking to launch a new proactive campaign to crack down on dangerous drivers as they move past buses. We'll keep you posted on all of that. For now, though, back to you guys in the studio.